Hey guys, uh, we're here at a neighbor of mine's garden. It's been pretty much a little trial uh, area. We uh, plant things and we'll fertilize one row and see what happens. Um, you'll see um, in the pictures or the videos about the different comparison of with and without the fertilizer. And you don't have to be very sophisticated in terms of uh, methods of doing this. So just uh, elementary kind of rain pouring sprout and just walk through the garden it just saturates the leaf real good the finer the spray better it is and you want to water it water it till the water drips off the end of the leaves and obviously here it seems like I'm wasting it but it's still going into the soil so we're getting two for one we're getting foliar feeding and drenching the soil as well so typically um, what I've experienced is the ability to see a difference in two to three days after you apply the fertilizer. It's systemic, and it means that the leaf absorbs it right away. You want to do it in the shade or early in the morning or late in the evening. Just you don't want the sun cooking the fluid and evaporating it so the sun evaporates it before the plant's able to absorb it. Um, I'm running out of product here. Then we'll go uh, show you about the uh, the corn. Whenever you get about three to four inches of uh, green coming out of the ground, that's about the right time to start, you know, fertilizing. Um, really, the default that I use is as soon as I get four primary leaves on the plant, I start fertilizing once every two to three weeks. And you'll see the difference. And I challenge you to do one with and one without and uh, give us some feedback on the website. We've had a tremendous amount of um, results. So uh, we'll go over in a second. I'll refill my can, finish this up, and we'll go over to the corn area, and I'll show you about that. Thanks.